John Hammond, The Fog. The Fog, John Hammond. It was a beautiful Sunday morning when my wife dropped me off and said lovingly, Focus. <laughs> Don't screw this up. <laughs> Mr. Contest Chair, fellow Toastmasters, and our most welcome guests, as the massive doors open to the place of reverence. Ah, the Home Depot! <laughs> I step in, I go totally blank. I have entered the hereafter. I have no idea what I'm hereafter. <laughs> Luckily, there was a very friendly man named Steve in an orange apron that greeted me. Now, I know his name is Steve because it's written right here in Black Magic Marker. He says, welcome to Home Depot. He couldn't be nicer. What can I help you find? Steve, thanks for asking. I'm looking for a reason I'm here. <laughs> Yeah, aren't we all? <laughs> no, Steve, I came here with a very specific mission, and I've totally forgotten why I'm here. Perhaps you can start with that. Dude, you're on your own. <laughs> well, maybe it's over in hardware. Home Depot is much like an adult daycare. <laughs> People wander around from aisle to aisle, not knowing where they're going, and there's not a salesperson in sight. <laughs> because my philosophy is when you have a real question, they scatter. <laughs> like cockroaches when you turn on the light. <laughs> little tiny cockroaches with little orange <laughs> There are other people in the fog standing in the hardware in front of a hundred feet of nuts and bolts. Just staring. <laughs> They're looking for the perfect wingnut. Now, a wingnut's a fastener. It's not really my drinking buddy. However, for the record, he is the perfect wingnut. They want four wingnuts in one package. You can't do that in Home Depot because they only come in packages of three. <laughs> That's the evil empire. Maybe it's in plumbing. In plumbing, there are five or six guys sitting on the floor <laughs> playing Go Fish. <laughs> Each has a pile of PVC parts, and it goes like this. Hey, Mac, got a two-inch double slip? 90 degrees? Nah, go fish. <laughs> and on it goes. They're trying to recreate what they dug up in the yard after they told their wife, honey, five minutes. Top is easy, easy. Five hours, $500 later, it's more like it. They'll be back because they'll come back four or five times in one day to finish their project. Man, I know why I'm in the fog. I'm hungry. I'm just going to take another trip around Home Depot to find that world-famous Home Depot foam <laughs> food court, only to discover what you already know. There is no food court, right? <laughs> Wouldn't it be nice if they had a snack bar just like Costco? <laughs> you could get a hot dog, or you could go to the Hairnet Cafe. <laughs> That's where you have the nice ladies with the orange hair dress and the orange aprons with food samples. You can eat for free. <laughs> Tacos and tools, pizza and plumbing, beer and building materials. <laughs> oh my goodness, look at the time. I've been here for 30 minutes and I still haven't gotten what I came for. I should have brought my wife with me. You know, she's my wingnut. She keeps me on track. She keeps me accountable. Who is your wingnut? Who keeps you accountable? Who keeps you on track? 
look at the person next to you and say, would you be my wing nun? <laughs> Some of you did that. <laughs> wing nun or not, I really feel that my wife keeps me on track. <laughs> I'm still in a fog, though. What's the fog? F-O-G? Forgetful old guy! <laughs> That's me. Hey, there's a tool sample. In the same kit, with the same battery pack. You can get it where it does a flashlight, a saw, a drill, a coffee, and waffle maker. <laughs> got to get me one of those. I grab my tool package with pride and I take it over to self-checkout. <laughs> if it's self-checkout, why does it take four people to get you out the door? <laughs> <laughs> so true. I take my package of tools and on my way out, I grab Steve. Buddy, you're coming with me. You got to help me. Please explain to my wife that it's not my fault. <laughs> Honey, look. Look at this toolkit I've got just for you. <laughs> Steve's one. <laughs> he looks at me and says, where is your list, wingnut? <laughs> oh. Mr. Contest Chair. <laughs> <laughs> 